like a hell cut. I've videoed this since the 15th episode of my Minecraft survival Minecraft Dungeons Let's Play. And in this episode, we are looking for runes uh, which unlock the, the, the fifth and final secret level. So, as you can see, we've got four out of the five secret levels. Then, that last one's here, and we are, we are unlocking the runes to try and get them. So, uh, the first one is actually in Creeper Woods. So, uh, let's get on and uh, do that, shall we? I might as well put it on the easiest difficulty so we can just like sort of run through every, everything and uh, it won't take too long, I guess. These levels do take forever to load most of the time, so yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, sometimes I'm pretty much not past most of these because I don't particularly want to fight them. Okay, well, free you. Let's, uh, oh, hello. Right, well, oh, wow, I managed to dodge all of them. Apart from that one. I mean, I haven't really had any um, gear upgrades apart from... Yeah, I haven't really had any gear upgrades since the last episode. Apart from maybe these, the, the speed boots have gone up in power and so have... I've got this death camp mushroom, but other than that, nothing really of any note to, ha to hand that I have uh, upgraded. Hey, the, actually, the only thing I will uh, kill is the creepers, because they are very annoying. Fact, I'm gonna switch out that for that. What am I doing? I'm not gonna be going this way. Or maybe I am. I don't know no, these days. Ah, oh, we go around here and up here, okay. Right, Shadow Brew definitely needed. here now so you have to so the way you do is you have to get to the bit where you have to free the villagers and we're in a spider battery bit now hey these guys don't even do that much we have to dodge around these guys oh yeah you can you can only access these runes once you have defeated the arch illager i might as well get this chest Yeah, so once you only want to defeat the Arctic Illager, can you um can you access the runes? And I defeated the Arctic Illager in the last video, if you haven't seen that. Well uh, best you know, best check that out before you've uh, watched watch this one because you won't be able to do anything before you've uh, defeated the Arctic Illager. Let's just say the Arctic Illager is very hard to defeat and he um, may have given me a bit of trouble uh, a couple of times and I may have died to him a couple of times. Here, right here. Well, I might as well get rid of these guys. 
one plan here. So you have to go to where the villages are, then you have to go straight to the, to the left. And you have to come to where these sort of weird mushrooms are popping out here. This like sort of coloured plant, like blue, like, like turquoise blue, like neon blues like sticking out. And then you have to travel in here. And here you are. This is the uh, this is the place with the rune in it. So actually, oh no, there we go. Ah, this is the problem I had before. Maybe if I just return to camp, maybe. Okay, well, I'll, I'll sort out my stuff and I'll come back once I'm placing it in. So I'll see you then. Okay, guys, we are back and we are now going to put, place the first rune in the church. If I just go over here. Please say we didn't drop it when we died. Actually, we don't normally, so... There we go. Wait, is that... What? Did I not place any? Or is it just not working for some reason? I'm pretty sure I placed the rune in here. Okay then, so that's um... Oh, I'll quickly go and check whether I did actually have the rune or whether I didn't. And I'll come back to you once I have cleared that up. So yeah, I'll see you once I've cleared that, that uh, up. So yeah, bye. Uh, no, not bye, but like, see you then. Okay guys, we're back and I have uh, saved you the hassle of having to watch me uh, watch the, the game load. So yeah. So we are here now in uh, Swaggy Soggy Swamps and this one is actually right near the end so I just set it on the easiest difficulty so I don't have to do much. Just uh, yeah, take out a couple of these guys and yeah. So yeah, so it's at the very end of Soggy Swamps right next to where the boss is. So if I just kill this witch. Yeah, these guys should be too hard to take out. I mean, each one only does like four damage. So. Everyone okay, we'll have to kind of destroy the bruise. One left, one left, one left. Uh, and then this way. Okay, which is even going to get lost? And then here's the gateway. Uh, yeah, I will also be showing you how to get each of the secret levels on each of the each of the four five secret levels. Well, this is this. I guess this is like the first episode of that. So yeah. Uh, now I have to fight him. Well, he wasn't very hard. Hey, wait. Which way do I go? This. Ooh. This way. Around here. Dodge around these guys, dodge around these guys. Oh no, we've gone the wrong way again. 
It's this way. So yeah, basically, basically to get this room, you have to complete the whole this level, and you, you can only unlock the runes as I was thinking. I've already said, but you can only unlock the runes once you've uh, completed the whole game. So you have to defeat the archiliger, which I did in the last episode. If you want to go back and see, if you haven't already seen that, I guess you should uh, go back to the last episode, to watch that, and then come back and watch this one. But yeah, so we have to we have to defeat the archiliger. And and then and then yeah we're gonna find all these I think there's like nine runes that have to be placed in that temple place that I showed you earlier. To unlock this uh, secret level. Uh, second end demand shouldn't be too bad. Because I mean I deliberately set it on the easiest mode to uh make it so I wouldn't have any trouble getting through it and it means it'd be a lot quicker for both for all of us. Okay we're almost there now. I remember when I found this boss really really difficult or like uh, no, well, not really really difficult but semi difficult. Or semi difficult, however you want to say it. I hate those baby zombies, the baby zombies are so annoying sometimes. Okay then, so along here. down here and yeah you will realize that I'm not actually exploring these very much is because I want to get through them as quick as possible to show you where you have to find these rooms well I might as well collect whatever is in here it might be a speed potion that would help us that actually it's not worth going for because I would just die a bunch of times and slow myself down See so if you know how to drop down and stuff, like skip out and skip out quite a lot of this. Perfect to help a um, speed potion. Well, that didn't take too long. Okay, so here, once you've defeated the, the cauldron as I just showed you, you have to go in here and go to this pillar here. And you can see there's an interactable button, so if you push it, this wall will fall away and you go in here. And here is the next rune. One's a T, apparently. I'll save you having to watch the loading screens, and I will come back. Once Large I have finished it, once, I have, no once, I'm, once I'm, I'm ready to put it in, so I'll see you the then. Okay guys, we're back and uh, so let's go and put this in the, the next rune in the uh, in the temple. This is the T rune. There we go, that is that room placed in. I think the ones that light up will be the ones that I've already completed maybe, so... They stay in light up? No. So uh, I will uh, reorganize my stuff, probably spend these uh, 200 emeralds and then I'll come back to you once I've done that and we are ready to find the next place. Yeah, I'll come back to you once I'm ready to find said 
uh, next rune. Okay guys, we're back and I have uh, finished sorting our stuff out. I haven't spent any, more, any, any, any emeralds yet, but I guess I don't need to at the moment. So now um, we're going to into Cacti Canyon, which is uh, this one. Let's go for the uh, second easiest difficulty, since we can't put it on the easiest difficulty. I guess that one's locked, because otherwise it'll make it way too easy. Okay, now we have to wait for it to load. Probably should have... Uh, skip this bit out to be honest because this is like the boring waiting bit oh here we go the arch illager nope. don't want to see that okay so i'll show you are you actually going to wait for me thank you okay it's not to go along here yeah these guys are easy perfect I did, I did sell to try and explore each level, so uh, let's just ignore most things. Apart from the creepers, the creepers are the most annoying. I mean, this this uh, blade thing is one shot with everything, so it should be too too bad. Might as well go for this chest. You can go as well. Guy out. We're close now, I think. Great, we've got one of those two guys trying to block away. Yeah, no, you're not doing that. Okay, so now I have to find, the, find and activate the beacons. Oh. Be the second one. Might as well go to this little chest over here as well. the final one so there okay so now where's the last one oh it's over here oh why did i just jump down that was so stupid i think nothing useful i don't think we can get anything even like that much useful out of this Unfortunately. And long hair. So we have to get to the bit where I have to get the keys. I mean, if you've watched, if you've watched my episodes, you would know what I mean by that. If you haven't, you should go back and watch the rest of the episodes before you come and before I finish this one because otherwise you won't understand what's going on. Of course, as, as, of, as of any episode. You know. Oh, great, okay. Dead Horseman. 
I'm, I'm them in. I haven't had, ever had them, I don't think, actually. That's a, a first for that mini boss. I, at least I can say I defeated it now, even if it was on the easiest setting. I wonder, can those guys fix onto the creepers, like upgrade the, upgrade the creepers? Right, so here... We need to go, I forgot where we need to go for this, actually. So yeah, we need to find the keys. Yes, they can, apparently. Oh, we have to go down here. So, and so to get this one, you have to go to where the blue key is. So you, you have to, um, to, to, get, to get the red, to get the yellow key, you have to unlock the blue key. But you have to go over this little ledge here, on the left side of the uh, of this little uh, like sort of square of uh, stone. And you see there's in, another interactable button. And so you have to press this, and the door. Oh great! Well, we have to, we have to defeat these guys first, apparently. There we go, that wasn't very easy, that wasn't very hard. So now, instead, instead of picking this guy up, we go behind here. This is, I think it's like a weird Y salt symbol. So then we can pick up this. Perfect. Yeah, we don't even need to complete the level so. Okay, we are back now and we have to um we have the third room to put to put in its place. Let's go over here. I think these might be all these all these paintings on the wall might be all the creators behind uh behind Minecraft dungeons, but I'm not don't quote me on that, I'm not actually sure of that. There we go, that places the next one in. Now I'm going to uh, load up the next map and I'll show you where we have to place everything, uh, where the next um, rune is. So I'll see you once I have loaded up the next um, level, so I'll see you then. Hey guys, uh, so we're back and we're in Pumpkin Pastures and this is where the next rune can be found. So yeah. So I did have to load up the, the level again because I didn't want you guys to uh, be bored with watching me watching that loading screen. I mean, the only potion that's like actually any use is like swiftness and the stealth potion. Actually, that's quite useful. Let's see, is there a chest up here? Yes, there is, but I just didn't fall off. Perfect. Hey, I did it. Uh... Hey, well, I'll take all of that. And of course, I fall off again. It's stealth potion, nice. Yeah, I said it's on the easiest difficulty again because I didn't want to uh, it to be too hard. I feel like we can run past everything basically. And there we go. So I believe we're actually coming up to it now. So as you can see, there is a uh, sort of like a broken wall here. And so like you sort of yourself go on in, onto the broken wall, but like you go onto this bit here. And right behind these... Oh, oh okay, I might, I might as well get a chest at least. Oh, and I fell off. Am I here? Where am I? Where am I? Oh, the wall's over here, okay. 
Oh, I'll come back all the way over here. Okay, so, let's get up on this wall. Let's just climb up here and get up on the wall. Uh, let me just take this so nothing else follows me. Get up on the wall over here. And then uh, get up here and go across on the wall over here. And then behind these boxes here, you can see there's another pushable button if you push that. You can get enter, enter into this door here, and you can get the next room. It looks like it's sort of you, maybe. Hey guys, so you know what I do from here, so I'll, I'll cut back once I've uh, got to the church, so I'll see you then. Okay guys, we're back and now let's uh, deposit this in the, in the, uh, in the church. Okay, so now we only have five left, so we're like pretty much halfway. So I'll load up the level again and I'll see you once I've done that. Okay, so our fifth one, our fifth rune is in the um, the redstone mines. And here, uh, you have to go to the second room of villagers. So the room, so there's two rooms of villagers where you have to save the villagers. And so you have to go to the second one and that's where uh, the, uh, the room will be. So uh, let me just get there first. I mean, it shouldn't be too bad because I said all that. This is it to the easiest difficulty. How well, that wasn't too difficult. Perfect, a stealth potion, so let's go this way. Ow. Perfect, another stealth potion. Might have to wait for this one to run out, and... Okay, so this is the first room where you have three other villagers. Another stealth potion, nice. For you. Oh, I'll collect up all these arrows whilst I'm here. And through here we go. Might as well collect up all these. Ah, oh, great, there's an Avoca, my favourite. Well, actually, although, actually, it's almost, almost like one of the easiest difficulties, so it shouldn't be that bad. Probably no point going for this, this pig, but... Probably didn't pick up and be useful. I might as well kill these slimes, or the slime. Let me just get past a bunch of these monsters. Second supply box, might as well go for this. Nice, leveled up again. Okay, and another spawner, nothing too problematic, and another one here. Okay, 
Okay then, so here, well I might as well free this guy. And let's spatch on all of these guys. Free this guy. And this guy. And then oh, right over here in the very left corner of the uh, of the whole place. There is a button here in the right in the very left corner, you see I can't go any further. And this is like the, the gate where it's locked. So on the on the place where I think this might be the place where we have to go. So right here on the very left corner, press this press this button here in this part, little pile of redstone and go in here. And now automatically fall off of course, perfect. And this looks like some sort of F maybe. Yeah, sorry, sorry if this is actually, this is actually not quite a long episode by the way, or quite a short episode. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to get all the rooms, finding all the rooms over and done with. Uh, so yeah, okay we're back and let's go and place this room right where it belongs. This is room number five. And the next room will be in Desert Temple of course. There we go. Four left. So now let's go and find this one in the desert temple. See, once I've done that level. Okay, and we're back. And um, so this is this is actually a um, a level I can actually do quite quickly because this is the level I did. When I was uh, so this is a tactic where, where you farm for unique, so you for unique weapons and armors, which I'll also show you because it's quite close to here. So, so I can actually run through this level quite quickly now because I've had a lot of practice at it. Right, why did I come down here? This is obviously not the way. As you can see, these guys are like super easy because again, I put it on easiest difficulty. And this one, this level has traps, of course. I hate the traps; they're so annoying. There are a couple of secrets I can show you on this one. Okay, so first of all, the rune is. I have to go in here. Go to where you have to find the, you know, the golden key you to unlock the next level. You have to activate this. Then you have to go to go to this golden key, but instead of picking up the golden key, because that's not what we're here for this time. Although it'd be nice to have him. You have to actually go into the secondary room. That like it's like here. Oh, that's much that I thought most of the time was here pointlessly. But actually, you go behind this like bush sort of thing. And there's a lever which if you pull. And unlock this bit and if you travel in here this is the next rune here we go okay so now I want to show you a secret chest that you can also find in here sometimes it won't always happen Sometimes the room layout will be slightly up off. So yeah, we click, pick up this key, we have to. And then we put the key in here. And we go through here. And then there's a secret chest. Ow. And we have to go in here. Oh, and it's the wrong layout. So this is the layout you don't want. So you want it to be the other way. But you go to this bit here, and then you roll across here. As you can see, you can hear sort of hear the opening. But as you can't, as, as you can see, you can't actually get in here. So yeah, you don't actually want it to be uh, 
this layout that the other you want it to be the other layout so so you want it to be sort of orientated so oh, i can't really describe it to be honest but yeah i'll come back once i have uh once i'm ready to put the rune in the, its place so i'll see you then hey guys we're back and we have the so we're going to church to go into the church again to place down this next rune i don't know why i had to make this church so long because it's so annoying to walk up Okay, then you place it in here. There we go, three left. Okay, well, I'll see you once I'm ready to show you where the next one is. So I'll see you in the next level. Okay, so we're in Fiery Forge now, which is where the next one is. Actually, I probably should stop saying that because it's quite obvious because there's one on every level. So there's one on every level apart from the secret levels. So it doesn't matter here if you, whether you have unlocked any of the secret levels or not. Okay, well, that's uh, some good for nothing armor that I can probably sell for some animals. And now I can't move. Great. You know what they should do? They should make the AI of the of the monsters stay move out of the way of the uh, move out of the way of the TNT. That makes the TNT a lot harder to use. Maybe then they can plant the damage of the TNT as well. And if you go inside here, so now once you're inside and you finish this snowy part, you come over to the left side of the room again, and you can see this switch here. So it switch that down, and it will open up this secret entrance here. And again, you have another rune on your hands. Looks like this is the... Some sort of K, maybe? Something else. Or C. Quite hard to tell with these runes. I'm to pick this up. And run out of here. Okay, well, well, I'll see you once we're ready to put this rune in the, ch in the, ch in the um, church. And so I'll see you once we get back. So see you then. Hey, we're back in the uh, back in the church now. So let's go and place this rune in. And here we go. Now we only have two runes left. So I'll see you once I've loaded up the next level and we are able to find the next rune. Okay, so the next one is in high block halls. You know, run along here and this one is actually quite a long one you have to actually complete half the level I just run I hate those guys like the big tough guys because got the shield and stuff Ah, stealth push the car, yeah. Oh, okay, down there. Where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, went the wrong way. Went, went the wrong way. Around here. By the end of the time, I'm going to have so many mobs chasing me, aren't I? Up here. Well, that went successfully, I think. Okay, then we'll go around here. Oh, some more arrows, perfect. Oh, now we have to do this bit, which is where to defeat a certain amount of enemies. Okay, then. 
my friend. This guy just born. Then why is still here? I won't shoot him. Yeah. So long. So die, die. I don't waste that now. One last guy to take him out. Or not. These walking tanks are no match now. I remember when I used to think this, this level was so hard, it's not too bad anymore. Potion, just what I need it. I believe it's down here. No, of course not. And these will be very nice. Up. Well, that went very well, didn't it? First death on collecting these, I think. Now, so this is the best place you want to be. You want to be in as well the outside market area sort of thing. And if you just kill a bunch of all the enemies that get in your way, of course. And you head over to the right hand side this time. You have to walk up here. And you head to the far right hand side, right next to this building that you can actually get on top of. You will find a switch right here. Or I guess it's like sort of like a turny thing. Where that turns I guess maybe. And you unlock this secret entrance here. And guess what? It's another rune. And die of course just instantly fall off. Oh, well that's a strength potion that I do not need right now. Okay, and this is the next rune. Okay, and now I'll come back to you once I'm ready to place this in the church. So I'll see you then. Okay, we're back and we have got the next rune and let's go and put this in the church. Okay, last one and then we have unlocked the secret level. So I will come back to you once I'm ready and I've loaded up levels. So I'll see you then. Okay guys, so we're back and, and the last one is of course on Obsidian Pinnacle. But there are, this is a different scenario. We don't want to blaze through this level. Well, we can't because we want to actually set this level at the highest difficulty. And I'll tell you why once we get to the chests. But for now, we actually have to defeat all these mobs and not die. Wow. 
Again, with this level, we have to actually complete part of the level before you actually get to it. Nice strength potion, very yeah, useful. Hey, no. Doink. Doink, doink. Oh, okay, that just brings me back. Great. That basically wasted the time off my um, my sharpness or my strength potion. I don't want to explore particularly, so that's okay. Some more arrows. Maybe I should start using the arrows. So I'm actually going to be, de be defeating the final boss in this set, in this uh, part. Nice with nerves. Don't want to jump on that, or do we? No, yeah, we do. Well, we'll have to hit this one nice and slowly. Since I said it on the hardest difficulty, uh, yeah. Since I, well, since I said on the hardest difficulty, everything's gonna be quite tough. Let's just run away from that, shall we? Oh, great, it's this area. Nice strength. have it. Run along here. Right, it's weapon. Great, I died. Lucky me. Right, let's, let's actually make them come over here so they come out of the enchantment. Oh, I've run out of arrows, well, that's perfect, just perfect, isn't it? Actually, we'll get some more arrows than the supplies here. Oh, well, that will give me a chance to see how many arrows you actually do get in the supplies as well. A bit of myth busting for you, it's uh, 53. Oh, I think it's uh, however many you start with. So, so you know how when you're in, when you're in like, the camp, you have a certain amount of arrows in your bow, uh, so it's, I think it's that number of arrows you get from each chest, so it just depends on what bow you have, how many arrows you actually get. Nice swiftness. Perfect. 
I don't particularly want to fight this guy, so let's just go run around him. And then we'll go in here. And so, this is the bit where, you, where you're going to be finding it, I think. Okay, an evoker is just what I wanted. And I'm already almost dead. Lucky me. Great, I died again. I've got like one more life left. I'm gonna run. Okay. Run, 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 run. I think I might have run past it, but great last chance. Nice one. Nice going. It might be up here actually. I have to go. That's not. It's not. It's not. Shoot. Stealth potion, I really need that right now. No, 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 this isn't good, this isn't good, this isn't good. Great! That's just perfect, isn't it? Right, well, I'll, um, I'll come back to you once I've actually got to the right place, and I am ready to uh, make get the key. Or get the uh, rune, I'm sorry. So I'll see you once I'm there. Okay guys, we're back. And you have to sort of come to get to the next one. Oh my god, take these guys out. You have to come to sort of this library place in, inside in on the inside of um of the of the map. And so you have to run down here and you have to come to sort of this library place. And yeah. And you go in here, and then you see this, this interactable book. If you uh, pull this, a, um, a thing will open up, and you can get your next rune. But this is why you want to set it to the max difficulty. Right here, because there are two chests here, and if you set it to the max difficulty, yeah, well, you, you, you have, you're more likely to get a better weapon from it. Now yeah, if I unlock this, that was a soul crossbow. Oh my... I have a lot of loot here. Unwanted, 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 unwanted. Ah, oh, mate, if I want anyone that's... Oh, not needed then. I'm not open this one. Not needed. Right, so I'll go back to base and I'll see you there. See you when I get there. Hey guys, we're back and we're now in the church. And boom, that is all of the rooms placed and it looks like there is a new secret area and there we go, we have now unlocked the new cow level, it's basically a, a, a one full of moose rooms, let me just check, am I holding the best stuff, no, and now let's see what we get from this, hey nothing useful, and again, nothing useful. Don't need that, don't need that. And now I can swap back out that. Perfect. Part of that since we have nothing else to do, use, do, use it with. And there we go, if I go back to the map now. go and if we go over here see now we have this the next secret mission which is very nice
So, I will thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss when I upload a new video. And uh, hopefully I helped you find all of the new, uh, all of the, um, the runes so you can find the secret, so you can find the secret, the very secret level. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.